Well, tell me your first year uh, in the CFL, first camp, and joining a group of uh, established uh, mm -hmm. veterans and, and a core here. What's it been like? Man, this is a great group of guys, great veterans. Um, they was very accepting. Uh, our DB room is a really talented DB, DB room, and we have a lot of good players that can really uh, play the ball and fly around. So it was just really coming and enjoying myself and be, just playing with them guys and enjoying the game of football. Yeah, coming in, is it not having any expectations? And when, I, when I, I'll attach that to what you've been doing this week, you've been with the ones in that secondary all week. Yeah, just going out there and just playing at a high level, which I know I can play at, and just being confident and doing that. And just having them guys is going out there and uh, with that confidence in me mm -hmm. to be able to make plays and do the things that I can do on the field. So it's just, just grateful for this opportunity and mm -hmm. glad to be here. What's the steepest learning curve with this league and with, the, with this game? Um, just more people on the field and yeah. a little bit faster tempo, uh, but... At the end of the day, it's still football, and it's still uh, you get to put on pass and just go out yeah. there and tackle and everything. So I feel like just that and uh, just getting used to the game and the rules and stuff. So mm -hmm. just getting used to that, and then once once that you get used to that, it's just the same as uh, football. All right, so we got to talk about the knockdowns, mm -hmm. which I know should have been interceptions, you're probably thinking, right? It's right. funny, at the end of the season, you go, oh, Darius Pratt got 12 knockdowns, but it doesn't tell you what happened. <laughs> right. And you're probably going, I should have had like six interceptions instead of 12 right. knockdowns. But tell me about, uh, as Coach Jones called it, mops, mm -hmm. you know, missed opportunities, and, and just how you bounce back from that, because you could be a real difference maker if mm -hmm. you turn the ball over, right? Right, right. just stay in discipline, you know, just being there when the ball there, just doing your job every play, because mm -hmm. everybody got a job to do on the field, so... When the ball comes my way, just find a way to get it instead of not just knocking it down exactly. Yeah. So this will just want to be a playmaker and just taking the ball away. Yeah. Darius, what's your what's your background? Where, where do you come from, and what about your game mm -hmm. suits you for where you are? Now? Um, so I, I came from Virginia, Roanoke, Virginia. I went to uh, the University of Virginia, and uh, I had a lot of coaching staff. I had a coaching staff, good two two good coaching staffs at the University of Virginia. So they taught me a, a lot of good football. And um, I know I work back home. My brother, he played in Europe uh, some time ago, so he taught me a lot about the game as well. So it's just coming up here and just trusting in the process and trusting in technique and trusting in the fundamentals of the game. Right. You're a long way from home, but it's, it's not Europe far, right? <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. Yeah, yeah, far away, but it's not it's not Europe. So yeah, I know he came back and taught me a lot about my football and stuff. So. I uh, give my brother a lot of props. Is, is he that much older than you? Did you, did you, did you yeah. watch him play? Oh, yeah, I watched him play in high school and in college. He was a great player and, and everything. So uh, I just take away from his game and try to mock everything that he does and stuff, just add it to my game and what I'm good at as well. Was, was there ever any doubt you were going to be a football player after? Uh, yeah, I played baseball in the day, so we uh, back in the day. So we I really didn't like football when I was little, <laughs> but <laughs> but – uh, he was like, I still wanted to play football. And he was like, oh, if you want to play football, we, we're going to be good at it. So we started working out uh, pretty, uh, pretty a lot. So it was it was fun. What, posi time. what positions did you play in baseball? Uh, baseball? Oh, yeah. I played Everywhere? center field, Ooh. first base, catcher, pitcher. Wow. Yeah, I was a baseball player back in the day. I thought I was going to play baseball in college, but yeah. it turned out to be football, you know. What, what was the switch? Did, did you make it or did it come um, I think it was I made it in high school when my uh, my recruiting was okay. not there in high school, so I just made that switch to football and just wanted to focus on that. That's not, not a bad role model to have uh, to, yeah. to make a switch like that if you're not going to be uh, yeah. Plan A, right? Yeah, exactly. Plan B, yeah, right, exactly. What are you learning from the veterans uh, with Ed Gainey and you know even Aaron Grimes and uh, Luches Purifoy? It's hard not to notice them out there. Oh man, <laughs> they're very vocal. You know, they're very they're great leaders on the field, and they demand the best out of you. Mm -hmm. So I just love that about that group. They won't let me uh, be lower than my standard of my yeah. best. And you know, so they just push me every day, and they're fun to be around. The DB room is fun, and uh, Bi he's a great coach so far. So we're just growing, and we're going to do some great things this year. There was a lot of competition out there coming into mm -hmm. this camp. Where, where, where did you think you were going to wind up on that? Um, I really didn't really focus on that. You know, I just went out there and just played football and have fun. You know, that's all about the game. Just bring that childhood, uh, that childhood joy for the game back to, to, back to the game. So 
I just let the pieces fall off on and just go out there and play my best. Did you have any preconceived notion of what the whole CFL was like, or did you know much about uh, it beforehand? I knew a little bit about but the CFL, but I didn't know much. So coming up here was pretty new, okay. new for me. So it would, but it's been a great uh, opportunity and a great experience so far. So I'm just grateful for that. Yeah. Stuff. Thank you, Darius. Thank you. Great to meet you, man. Thank you Best too. Good luck with so far. Thank you.